Well, folks, today we got a lot of disasters. We got toxic gamers going crazy. Drop a thumbs up. Don't chase that pom pom. Chase your dreams, okay? Because coming in at our number 12 spot, 50 Cent deleted both of his tweets of his alleged involvement in GTA 6. Now, a couple of days ago, he did tweet about Vice City, and there was another image, that second image that he tweeted, but he took it down. I made a dedicated video on the channel about the second image. Definitely check that out. But apparently, he did post about it, and he took it down. And when he first posted this, uh, a lot of people got hit in the G-spot. A lot of people Bruh. were shaking. A lot of people were doing helicopters with their woolies, thinking that this is about GTA 6. And understandably, man, because he did post about Vice City and a couple of months ago when we had that league gameplay a lot of people saw that I saw that you saw that we all saw that Lucia's Bunda let's uh, let's keep a buck 50 and some people are thinking that 50 cent could play that father role of uh, Lucia and I gotta drop a brown right. y'all dumbasses out there I mean it's a possibility but let's keep a buck 50 bro that Bunda of Lucia that's gonna be taking 50 gigabytes of space I don't think there will be any more space left for any more character here guys but the sus part here is that he ended up deleting the tweet did Rockstar cock block the homie or what y'all think let me know and we also are hearing that Sony will be buying take two we're gonna get to the story in a minute but check this out guys apparently Aaron came out he says that you can request plead and demand but sending devs death threats isn't the best strategy for getting information about a video game we recently had like some leaks about the gameplay some trailer leaks as well about spider-man 2 i made a dedicated video definitely check it out on the channel after the fact but apparently aaron is working on spider-man 2 and he came out recently and he said that he has been getting like heaven proposals uh, that the toxic gamers are everywhere they're trying to wash their hands they're trying to go in gang gang style and they rarely went in because he also responded by saying this boy Honest, sending the same threat to a community member will get you nowhere either. I mean Damn, well, kid, damn. Y'all really be sending heaven proposals? I mean, damn, son. This is a this is a new low, ladies and gentlemen. I just cannot even compute this, guys. But at our number 10 spot, this is some of the wildest story out here because breaking medical reports show that the nodules found in Andrew Tate's lungs are not cancerous. But then we started hearing this report that Andrew Tate's manager confirms reports that he is diagnosed with lung cancer. Says that, okay, a lot of people are asking if Tate lung cancer story is true. Yes, it's true. Oh, I was shit. the one driving with him too and from the hospitals in Dubai I don't have any more specifics to share and some of the homies have even have Dr. Enif sharing uh, Far Cry Romania with three jets in the background uh, Someone's lying. I don't know who and we got people dropping DDT some even dropping a bicycle kick in the chat Ladies and gentlemen, this situation is absolutely crazy because so far Andrew Tate hasn't been charged I want to know your thoughts. He hasn't been charged. He has been detained. They're keeping him chained up while they're looking for evidence that's their official words let me know your thoughts on the situation because this is absolutely wild and check this out right so this is a brand new game or in fact not even a brand new game this is a game that has been around for decades y'all might be thinking this is like brand new call of duty gameplay but this is roblox gameplay <gasps> Yes, this is Roblox gameplay. This is free to play and they have made this graphically speaking. It is looking beautiful It's looking like Call of Duty. It even have throwing knives. I mean, damn man, that is insane And the fact that Roblox is getting really up to that Call of Duty level that is wild I mean, I definitely love to see it guys definitely smash a like button Let me know what y'all be thinking on this situation because we got Call of Duty Do you want to play Call of Duty? That's $70 with skill based match freaking no new maps no new content or do you want to play this free to play game with no skill based mastering and that is looking like a snack and uh, the, the, the the movement system is kind of wild as well and studs and chads you might want to sit down for this story this is the biggest disaster in the gaming news right now i know this is going to ruffle some feathers this is going to get some people mad but understand this this is not my opinion this is what people are saying and this is what they're officially saying or check this out so an update from luminous productions now they are behind this game by the name of four spoken a lot of people are hating on this game and understandably so, so there are some people that are loving this game at one point it was the most pre-ordered game in japan those japanese homies were really looking for that pom pom they were really chasing that that four spoken pom pom now i'm saying but Bruh. but an update from luminous productions you may have heard the news that luminous productions is merging with square enix beningings uh any the beningings any the beninging yeah. In the beginning, on May 1st, our talented team, debatable, our talented team will join Square Enix to deliver new innovative gaming experience to players across the globe. And guess what? Quickly after, 
People got mad, man. People got mad. Check this out. Forspoken so goddamn bad, it killed the studio after only one game. No matter how rebozo you won't be missed. Genuinely feel bad for the devs and artists who are gonna get Shiza, Kane, while execs and CEOs get sweet, sweet severance packages, and Joss, I know who doesn't get his game giant bath as a hand is shoved into a new snowball. Right. Now, they are officially saying that it's a merger. It's not a shutdown, but the toxic gamers, they, they are not believing it. In fact, the homie Yongya, bro. Homie Yongya stock huge. We love the homie Yongya. Smash the like button. Let me know your thoughts as well in the comments. The homie looking like he's about to end some careers. Looking like he's not going to be chasing any pom pom anytime soon. Says that Square Enix shut down for Spoken Studio. Damn! Also, the homie Daniel and Choppy Floppy sent me this video. Roll it. What the hell is even that? What the hell? Bruh. Bomba cloth and there too. Watch what the hell, bro. It's very hard to see. It's one over here. There we go. It's one here. It's one over here. Look, look, this is not normal. And it's two over here. Watch this. What? Oh, hell no. Nah. Bomba cloth, bro. Bro. <laughs> Watch this. Like this. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the scientists have conducted the story, and apparently, we are hearing that UFOs were caught in Norway talking live, and he ended up capturing this footage. I also have the second channel. Check this out because this is where we clap alien cheeks. This is where we find that UFO content. So, if you're into that, definitely check it out. But for this story, we're going to be diving a little bit deep. Viewers' discretion is advised. And if anybody you know gets offended, send them this device free of charge. All you got to do is smash a like button, and it can be yours, and you can definitely send it to people you know who get offended because we're talking about sony ponies and the egg box okay because a us ftc judge has ruled that sony has to provide documents on microsoft revealing exclusivity contracts from january 2019 onwards as part of their investigation into the microsoft activision abk deal and this situation has been going for a while and this is all happening once Bruh. again i know i i know okay i know this has been happening all because of call of duty uh the FTC judge, however, denied Microsoft's motion to get information on Sony's executive team. The FTC judge ruling currently says that the information Sony provides will be kept redacted, but I do hope we get, see, we get to see Sony's deal with Activision on Call of Duty. Would be great to finally learn what's in it officially. And this is some of the biggest bumbleclad moment in the century because we got trained athletes, trained uh, professionals in the chat saying that, Dad, Dad, PlayStation. This situation has been so wild and the only person I feel like is capable enough to give you the expertise is the homie Roger, okay? Let me tell you something about Roger. Roger has this F around finding up meter and the more you F around, the more you find out and Sony has been effing around for a long, long time, okay? Even Microsoft is effing around and the situation here is that I know some of you will be like, Sizzle, uh, I'm kind of confused, like I'm kind of, <laughs> I, I need to know what the, why this is happening. Apparently the situation here is that there are rumors going around that if this deal doesn't go through microsoft will be selling xbox i made a dedicated video on that rumor i personally do not believe it but that's the news guys listen i'm just a messenger okay that's kind of like what we're hearing and now this is insane because we're also hearing that sony could be buying take two i'm gonna get to that story in just a little bit because apparently the homie Tom Warren came out. Microsoft's Activision deal likely to be approved by EU regulators, says Reuters. Licensing deals with Nintendo and Nvidia have reportedly erased competition concerns. And the bots are shaking. They're doing helicopters with their woolies. They're, they're trying to bring a Sony pony down. I mean, look at that, man. I mean, goddamn. And the bots are beating their chest. They're putting like maple syrup on their, their pancakes out there. It is just wild. These Sony ponies and the bots can never come together. Some of the wildest story here is that C CMA and the FTC was team Sony Pony. They were tag teaming. In fact, Google is still loyal to Sony, right? But Microsoft acquired, you know, not acquired, but uh, uh, bruh, right? They did not acquire, but they basically got Nvidia and Nintendo on their side. So they are tag teaming with Nvidia and Nintendo. Sony had FTC, but FTC betrayed the Sony Ponies and they're asking Sony, hey, you gotta tell us your exclusivity deals. You gotta tell us how much money you paid to keep the devs from putting their games on Xbox Game Pass because oh, if the games were going on Game Pass, Sony would lose money because uh, if the games can be bought for $10 a month or not bought, basically you would have to just pay $10 a month and the games would be yours. 
Sony didn't want that. Understandably, that's kind of like their business model. They don't want to be seeing those games coming to that Game Pass model. FTC is like, bruh, y'all gotta stop doing helicopters with your release. Y'all gotta let us know straight away. And now we're hearing that EU regulators might approve the deal. Previously, we heard that they will approve it. Then we heard that they will not approve it. Then we heard that they will approve it. Then we heard that they're not gonna approve it. Now we're hearing that they're gonna approve it. This is going back and forth. I would still say it's 50-50, but check this out, guys. Sony is reportedly preparing to buy Take to Enjoy. Interactive. <gasps> The purchase is believed to be Sony's response to Microsoft acquisition of Activision Blizzard if that finally gets the green light. And quickly after the Sony pony started shaking, the Sony pony started dropping that Bumbo Clyde, the Sony pony started like bringing a bot brother down and it's like a massive WW5 happening around the streets. The Sony ponies are wild and the Xbox are wild and, and I'm not even sure what's true anymore, ladies and gentlemen. With its most recent proposal plans, Microsoft is likely to eventually end up owning Activision Blizzard. The next question then would be, what will Sony do if that happened? If you believe our recent report, Sony will retaliate by making a similar massive acquisition. And I want to know your thoughts on it because some people are saying that Sony don't even have the money to buy Take-Two. Others are saying y'all are bozos. They have all the money in the world. They can buy Take-Two. And seriously, Take-Two is not that expensive. I, I mean, they're very expensive. I mean, $20 billion. Can a brother get like two pennies? Listen, I can go to China right now. I can buy 50 Take-Two studios for that two pennies, okay? Smash like button, subscribe right now if you know these are facts but seriously okay the situation here is that take two is only they are the ones saying only 20 billion 20 billion is 20 billion but Bruh. understandably <laughs> only 20 billion and surely the activision deal is 69 billion closer to 70 billion so this is way cheaper of a company and the rumor here is that sony could be buying take two i personally do not believe in the story but the rumor is that if the activision deal goes through that's when they're gonna buy it. if it doesn't go through maybe they're not gonna we all know rockstar games and sony they have a good relationship and we know that rockstar games has been cooking up that gts so if they seriously buy take two that's gonna be crazy okay but also apparently kaide reveals that she has cancer and she shares the updates on treatment she's one of the massive valorant streamer hi everyone i've recently been diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia i'll be starting treatment very soon with that being said i'm not too sure how my body will react to to the treatment so i do apologize in advance if my stream schedule isn't consistent stay safe i uh, definitely send your prayers our way and let's hope that she beat it but rockstar games came out they say that tom size who was behind uh, the character of Sony in Grand Theft Auto Vice City, he passed away. So RIP to him. It's gonna sound cliche, but love your loved ones. You never know when it's the last time you're meeting them, guys. But click on this video on the screen. We got the second teaser image for GTA 6, or click the video on the left because this deadass just happened. It actually, for real, deadass happened. Check these videos out, guys, and I will see you right there.